Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna do a speed clean. So I am actually, I have about 45 minutes to an hour before I go pick up my car from the dealership. I had to get my oil changed um, and they just called me and they said it's about to go through the wash in just a little bit. But I have a little bit before I need to go pick up my car, but my house just needs to be tidy up. So by no means, yes, I have a Trader Joe's Halloween sticker on my hand, my daughter put it there, but she is actually napping. My husband is napping. My oldest son, his chore was to clean up his bathroom. But um, I am going to go through and just straighten up downstairs. I also have laundry that needs to be folded. Never ending laundry. So I want to get that done as well before I head off to the dealership to go pick up my car. So if you guys need some speed cleaning motivation or you just need to tidy up your house, I'm gonna talk very minimal and I'm just gonna let the music play and let's get clean. I often find the kitchen to be one of the hardest chores. It's right in the heart of the home. It's right downstairs. My downstairs kind of has that open floor plan. So when the kitchen is clean, I feel better about getting the other tasks clean. So often when I am speed cleaning, I like to start with my most difficult or the chore that I don't like to do first. So then all the other stuff that I have to do is easier, if that makes any sense. How do you guys like to do it? Do you like to do the easy stuff first to give you that little bit of motivation or do you like to do the harder thing first? My kitchen wasn't in horrible shape, but it usually is just, it's probably one of my least favorite things to clean. So kitchen, did that first, got that out of the way, and then that gave me the motivation to get the other tasks complete, which were not as difficult. To wipe down the countertops, I was just using um, one of Mrs. Meyer's fall scents. Um, it is the acorn spice scent. Um, this year, 2020 has been really crazy and cleaning supplies are hard to come by. So any fall cleaning supplies I happened upon, I just snapped them up, even if they were my favorite scent or not. Um, because that is the struggle is really real. But um, let me know down in the comments below. I want to know what are you guys doing for the holidays? We have entered into my favorite season of the year. That's holiday after holiday after holiday. And even though they're gonna be a bit different because in California our rules are a little bit stringent as current, but hopefully they will lighten up just a bit as the you know numbers go down and all of that stuff. But um, what are you guys planning to do this fall season? We are still doing pumpkin patches, apple picking, and all of that fun stuff. I am still doing with my family. Most outdoor activities are still open and available for the kids to do. Um, but a lot of the indoor things are just not going to be the same. So let me down, know in the comments down below what you guys are doing. I told you guys I am almost finally done with the kitchen like it's not hard there's just a lot of little things countertops appliances all of those things that you have to wipe down and get clean but now we are moving on to the living room so like I said my little girl she's three years old she had just gone up to go take a nap and my husband went to nap as well um, typically we have her clean up her toys, but these are the few items that she left here. So I am first going to get all of this stuff put away. So decluttering, decluttering, decluttering is key for any speed clean. And then I will tidy everything up and then vacuum will be my last thing. So I will have to say straightening up the pillows makes my heart feel so happy. That and vacuuming, I just think that Boy, does it make the house look that much better. Even though I fix the <laughs> pillows on the couch 10 million times a day, it still makes the house look that much better for that five seconds that they are nice and clean and straight.
And now we're gonna make our way to my daughter's little play area downstairs. And it wasn't super messy, but there were just a few items that were out of place and we're just gonna put those back away. And like I said, I do have her clean up, but she's three years old. Sometimes some items don't get put away and everything is pretty neat and tidy and orderly so it's easy to just get everything cleaned back up. So I'm gonna do that very quickly and then we are gonna move on to the next task. I was running out of time. The kitchen, even though like I said, it wasn't hard, it took me a little bit longer than I thought it would take me. Um, so I was running out of time and I didn't get to the laundry and you'll see that later on until after I got back and much, much later in the night. Okay, now I'm back to another kitchen task. <laughs> so um, I needed to uh, mop really quick and I use this O Cedar mop and I love it because you can use any cleaner that you want inside of it. You can even use vinegar and water, which is probably one of my favorite solutions to clean with. So I'm just gonna do a quick sweep of the floor and it's nap time and then my oldest is upstairs in his room. Um, so the floors will get a little bit to dry. They actually dry so quickly with this mop. So I'm gonna do that. And then the laundry area also needed a good mopping. And I am gonna do that really quick before I make my way to my next task. Now we are at the downstairs bathroom and I am going to quickly tidy this up. This bathroom we probably clean the most because it is downstairs and it gets the most use other than the other two bathrooms that are upstairs, the master and then the kids bathroom. So this bathroom I feel like I am constantly cleaning, wiping it down and trying to keep it as tidy and as clean as possible. So we're gonna go through, I'm just gonna use that multi, um, multi all-purpose spray and just give everything a really good wipe down and then I will head off to go pick up my car. downstairs to play a video game so I am up in his room and I am just going to get this laundry folded really quickly. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with me and getting some of your um, things checked off of your to-do list and just getting your home clean and tight and ready for the week or the weekend ahead.
And then here is the after. Everything was clean, tidy, and in order. for watching this video if you enjoyed it don't forget to give it a thumbs up um, if you love cleaning motivation home decor motivation all of that stuff um, please don't hesitate to join my YouTube family I would love to have you a part of it but I will see you guys next time bye